There we go. Whoops. Getting set up here. Almost done. What? So I just a really cool pull someone got. Anyway, let's keep getting set up. We only have two breaks today. We're gonna get through them pretty quick. Okay. All right, guys. So it's the day after Valentine's Day. I hope everybody had a great day yesterday, and hopefully you took a little time away from uh, ripping packs to spend time with someone special and if you don't have a significant other in your life then hopefully you got a little bit more time to rip packs and watch some breaks but okay so we have let's get this out of the way couldn't figure out what I was rolling over I have a dog bed in here because dogs like to spend time with me. Okay, so we have two breaks to do today. Uh, let me go to get my mouse and we'll get going on these. So let's see, the first break is going to be we'll do them in, in the order they filled. So CW76 filled first, and that's the 1989 upper deck. There's 36 packs in here. We'll go through all, all of these packs fairly quickly. Uh, and we're going to be looking for Ken Griffey Jr., uh, that iconic rookie card primarily. And if we come across anything else along the way, that's great. Um, so We'll do that one first. I'm going to set up the random so that we can randomize these uh, spots. We have 36 spots here. We'll random those first. And then we'll take the packs out and open them up. Hey, Kevin, what's up? James, welcome, welcome. Let's get, uh, let's go to random.org. And then I'll pull the browser up for you here. Whoops. Let me just slap the camera around, make sure it stays in line here. What'd you guys do yesterday? Anyone do anything exciting or fun? While I get this random going, uh, let me show the browser so you guys can see too. There it is. Okay. Hey, Jen. Welcome, welcome. Anything exciting yesterday? Anyone have any uh, fun surprises that they received or were the sneaky party and gave to someone else?
This is, this break is CW76, right? Get my numbers mixed up here. Yep, 76. All right, so let's do the random for 76 first. Uh, as always, we are going to just random the spots. I'm not going to random the numbers on this. Any, even if it was teams, I wouldn't, but it would make no sense to randomize the numbers because um, we're just randomizing the pack order here. We'll apparently do it 10 times. And let me grab my list here of names. Welcome to everyone joining. Thanks for joining and watching. All right, so we're going to do this 10 times. We'll see what our pack order is. And then I need to pull all these packs out and number them. I was going to do that beforehand, but I wanted to uh, make sure that I open the box on camera so you guys can see it. I figure it'll take me about a minute to number them all. But it's more important for you guys to see uh, see it getting open and all of that stuff. So anyway, uh, FD memu F D M E M U is the verification code. Hey JT, welcome. And let me paste this over here. All right, there's our list. So there's our pack order. We'll get these packs opened up. Let me kill the browser and we'll get our packs going here. No sound. All right. So we can uh, we can say things about JT. Just don't repeat anything I say in chat. Otherwise he'll see. Okay. So there's our pack order. We're going to start with uh, Jared S and end with James H. And uh, a lot of names I'm not going to repeat them all in between this is going to take a second so we'll go ahead and uh, we'll go ahead and get these numbered um, just like previous times I have only there's a lot more of them now I have all this pack spots there so I can keep them in order try and put my camera back where I had it A heavy box so uh, to save time I'm also not going to sleeve anything uh, unless I find a Jeter not Jeter um, if we find the Ripken then I'll definitely sleeve that as we're going but otherwise uh, to save time I'll just put everything in their pack spots and then uh, I'll get that stuff sorted later to be fine this is a sealed box that I bought from uh, David M's Card World. It's a Reed's Buy, which is... Um... And here's something I noticed, too. A lot of the older... Uh, a lot of the uh, stuff you open has, like, tops or upper deck on the cellophane. This one does not. I noticed that, and I don't know if that's just because they didn't do that in 1989 or what. I'm guessing that's the case. And this is a, a legit box. I would hope so. Now we did have some luck last. Uh, here I'm going to open. I'm going to pull these out in the order that they are in the box, and just kind of maintain that order. And then we'll we'll order. We'll number them kind of like we did with the last one, hunting for uh, Jeter. And in that one, what we did is. Uh, well, there was only two stacks. We did one, two, and then the next one's down were three, four, etc. We'll do that, only we have this back stack here. And we're going to start with those. So one, two, three, four, and then all the way down the stacks. So I'll start num numbering these right now. We'll get going. It's going to take a minute. Three, four, 
And we're back up here to five. I actually had to label a couple new um, dividers. These, these white cards here are card dividers, sorting dividers. And I had to label a couple new new ones because I had only labeled up to 29 for some reason. And we needed 36 of these, so there's 9, 10, 11, 12, underline that one. Nothing exciting for, uh, I almost said for Halloween, for Valentine's Day. No one did anything uh, exciting or romantic or crazy or surprised someone or got surprised. My wife and I went out to a nice dinner. And I know how it is on Valentine's Day, so I made the reservations three, four weeks ago. There's 18, we're getting there. Uh, and then afterwards, I had some just nice dessert kind of stuff, some strawberries and whatever, just to, whoops, this is gonna be 20, to relax at home and that part I didn't tell her about. She knew about the dinner. So it was nice, just a nice relaxing night at home with the dogs, watched a movie. I turned my computer off at five o'clock. Well, I turned, that was 22. I turned Discord off. Well, hold on. I missed one. Hold on. 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18 is in the wrong spot. That's why. 19, 20, 21. I did two 21s, so 22, that's 22, 23, one's actually 23, 23, anyway, I turned Discord off, 24, at 5 o'clock, and, uh, and I actually had to work a little bit late still because I had a production issue, so I had to get that done. But otherwise, I stayed off the computer all night. and I figured that was probably what my wife wanted most for Valentine's Day. 27 is for me to not talk about sports cards and not be on the computer. Uh, yeah, this is 89 Upper Deck. 28. This is a pack random break. So, 29, 33, 1, 2, yeah. This is Sorry, I'm not catching up. I'm reading what everyone's saying, but uh, 33, 34. I'm trying to get through this real quick. 35, 36, 36, 5. All right. Whew. Once again, high on marker fumes. Oh, I can't even reach these backpacks. Okay. We have 36 numbered packs. I can't move the camera very much because the, the cord's kind of tight, but they're all numbered, so we can dive right in. Taco Bell and the best five minutes of real life. That's great. <laughs> ah, all right. That's funny. Hey, Kurt. Hey, Mark. Hopefully, we'll find a Griffey in here. Um, like I was saying, we did find Jeter in our last hunt. And so I'm hoping that luck continues with this box and we pull a uh, Griffey rook rookie out of this one. So let's start with pack one. Pack one's going to Jared. 
And I will be going kind of quickly, so uh, I'll be trying to pay attention a little bit to chat, but if I miss something in chat, I apologize. Uh, feel, for, feel free to repeat it. I'm going to put the packs back in here. Well, I don't need the packs. I have these cards to number them. It's fine. Okay. Uh, for anyone who hasn't seen the 89 upper deck, this is what they look like. When they first came out, they were incredible. Uh, no one had designs this clean. And everyone fell in love. And I think that's one of the reasons that the 89 upper deck Griffey is so important. Um, versus like the, the tops or another one. Anyway, so... Fortunately, we do have to go through every card. Because unless the rookies are in the middle or anything, which I, ju I just don't remember. It's been forever. Mookie Wilson. So, oh, I forgot about these. That's unfortunate. The sticker was stuck to the card a little bit on that Dodgers card. I forgot about these uh, hologram stickers. They did larger ones in subsequent years. But in 89, they were the tiny circles, which I forgot. Jim Dot, Fred McGriff. Walt Terrell. This will go a little bit slow because we have to go through... Every card, Eric Davis, Lloyd McClendon. I'll go kind of quickly, but also try and make sure you can see them. Yeah, there's still uh, there's still wax boxes. You can actually buy one right now on David Adams Card World. So no Griffey in pack one. Moving on to pack two for Mike O. This is pack two. Oh my goodness. There's our sticker. Pirates. Washington, Petri, uh, Dave Sevium, Louis, Louis Meadows. I don't remember everyone's name in here. Jeff Russell, Wally Black. Backman, Phil Bradley, Bruce Hurst. There's still uh, some other good cards out of this set, but uh, obviously Griffey is the one we're really looking for here. Steve Searcy. Daryl Hamilton. Bobby Bonilla. Jim Gott and Will Clark. There are, uh, if I recall, 15 cards per pack on these. So that was pack two. No Griffey there. Pack three. Oh, uh, let's do a contest. I will give someone a hit of some kind, of either a, a really good rookie or a jersey auto, something. If you can guess which pack, you have to guess. Um, you only get one guess. And you have to guess it before we find the Griffey. If we find more than one, if we find no Griffies, nobody wins. If we find more than one Griffey, then whoever guessed those packs wins. And if multiple people guess the pack, multiple people win. If 36 people guess pack 36, then I guess I'm giving away 36 autos if Griffey shows up in, in pack 36. So get your guesses in. Let me know. This is, uh, we're doing pack three for Aaron. Try to not be too slow with all of these, but, uh, it's kind of hard. You have to go through each one. Damon Berryhill, Mickey Brantley, Charlie Puglio, Smoltz, Jones, Reardon, DeJanes. I don't know. It's not Griffey. Royals. Uh, you can only guess... Uh, you can guess two packs. I don't think there would be more than... I mean, I think we'll be lucky to get one Griffey in here. If we were to pull more than... Um, 
And I'm talking about the iconic Riffy, Griffey Jr. rookie, the, the one we're specifically looking for. If we pull more than two, then uh, that's great, but I, I'm going to allow two guesses. Junior Felix, Rick Mahler. No Griffey in pack three. Start guessing now, because if it's in pack four and you haven't guessed, it's too late after I open it. Interesting. I've received 100 messages with Restream Chat. Okay. I don't think I've seen that before. And uh, feel free to let me know if your guess was correct, if we find the Griffey. Because I'm, I don't uh, enjoy the idea of going through and searching pack, back through all of them if nobody tells me they won. So I'll leave it up to you to let me know if you won. Uh, we have another sticker that's stuck a little. Oh, it's not not bad. Okay. Another Astros. What's going on, Astros stickers? Getting stuck. There's two cards there. Eckersley. And what we're looking for is the, the rookie like that. There's a Ramon Martinez with a bent corner, unfortunately. Colors. Oh, there's a couple of nasty corners in this pack. Sorry about that. Joe Price. Uh, this pack is um, 31 years old. So this whole box is 31 years old. That was pack four. Here goes pack five. Thanks everyone for guessing. I love it. I love playing the guessing games. I hate when I uh, offer free stuff and nobody guesses. It's like, you don't want free things? Okay. I mean, I don't hate it because less I have to give away, I guess. But it's more fun if, if people guess. Calhoun, Bobby Witt. So there's uh, Bobby Witt Jr. Is one of the uh, cards to look for this year, I think. And uh, I don't know if they're related to that. I don't know if that's like is a relation. Like a father, maybe an uncle or something. Oh, I haven't seen one of these in a while. There you go, guys. eBay one of one, Steve Farr. Crooked cut and, uh, and caught in the machine. That's fun. This is, uh, sorry, pack five is John S., Pack four was also John S. Sorry, John. John, by the way, I have, I think I have a note here that I owe you a bonus. So don't let me forget that. Ted Simmons. We had Andy Van Slyke a second ago. Paul O'Neill. Jerry Reed. Dave Martinez. Bob Brimley. Ray Kionis. Bob Boone. All right, nothing in pack five. Pack six is Jen. Bobby Witt is Junior's dad? Okay. Thanks, Jen. I didn't know. I, I mean, I kept seeing Bobby Witt Junior and not, you know, wondering if it was uh, the same family or whatever, but never took the time to look it up. So Dave Winfield, Dan Petrie. I don't know if you guys, it's kind of hard to read the names with the, got a little bit of glare here. Does that help? That helps a little bit. And Bosley, Flannery, uh, Mike Schmidt. I used to have a ton of Mike Schmidt rookies. And uh, there's David West rookie. And then I sold them in a garage sale when I was a little kid. Dwight Gooden. And I didn't know any better. Bo Diaz. And unfortunately, I found out later in life that they're worth a lot more than I sold them for. Way more. Randy Reddy, Bill Spires, and Blankenship. Okay, nothing in pack six. Moving on to pack seven. And my problem is I... Ted Simmons of 2020, what is that? What did I miss? This one's like not glued all the way. It was a little loose there, but it's glued the rest of the way. Like I had to rip it at the top. 
Interesting. What's the... This is pack seven, by the way, for uh, Jared S. What is the Hall of Fame 2020? Did I miss something there? Dwayne Ward, Luis Rivera, Roberto Kelly. Someone hiding behind Kelly. Jody Davis, Sean Hillegas. To try and count the cards because I could easily miss one. The way they, uh, they're they so tightly bound together. All right, pack 15 for Griffey. Yeah, I, I don't watch enough. I know there's two cards here. Nope, it's just one, Greg Matthews. Um, I don't watch enough baseball. Mel Hall, there's Mark Grace. To, uh, to even get some of the names right sometimes. Bob Walk, Vance Law, there's some names from the past. Pete Harnish, Fred Lynn for Detroit. If anyone doesn't want the cards from their pack or um, or doesn't want certain cards, whatever, uh, you only want your team's cards or whatever the case may be, let me know. Uh, I do donate any of the ones that you want donated. So there's pack eight for Ryan. Ryan, if you're watching, congrats to your buddy for that, that crazy pull. I saw that on Twitter. Spike Owen, Bob Boone. Daryl Boston, Jeff Russell. Oh, Ted Simmons goes in the hall this year. Okay. Larry Parrish. Well, that's cool. Dan James. Dave Clark. I haven't seen that card in a long time. There's a sticker. Astros again. Andy Hawkins. John Smiley. I always loved this guy's name, John Smiley. Jack Clark. Lance Parrish. Who's behind you, Lance? Who are you hiding? Uh, just Chris James. Jose Bautista. And here's a Griffey. There you go. We found the first one. Centering's not perfect, but it's not horrible either. So here's what we're going to do. I'm going to cut the edge of this sleeve because this is... I don't want to catch the corner of this card at all. So did anyone guess Pack 8? Because our first winner will go to Pack 8. And congrats, Ryan, for getting the iconic Griffey Jr. rookie. Oh, there's a little card dust in there. Get out of there. I don't like card dust on the inside of my sleeves. It's no good. These are thin cards, too. Okay. Sorry, guys. I want to take my time with it. Anyway, there you go. The first Griffey goes to Ryan. Congrats. And uh, I missed it. Did anyone... It, I don't see anyone saying they guessed Pack 8. So, Pack 8 for the first one. You know what I need to do? I need to grab my notepad real quick. Just in case we get a, a hit on these guesses. Yeah, I don't like the uh, I don't like any of the card shrapnel, any little card dust. I don't like it in there at all. Especially you get those chrome cards; it'll scratch that up. I mean, it doesn't move around in there a lot, but still, I would rather be overly cautious than have a card that is potentially valuable get scratched up by card dust. Okay, so I would normally. Put the card out here and show it but i want to keep it with with the pack it came out of so i'll leave it where it is all right moving on to pack nine that's not bad odds so um at this rate we should hit four griffies maybe that'd be incredible 
Okay, so let's move on. No one guessed eight. We're moving on to pack nine. Pack nine is for James. Good luck, everyone else. I'm hoping there's more than one per box here. That'd be great if there is. Some of these cards you'll see occasionally. This is Upper Deck's first year, so I forgive them. Uh, and I really wish they would come back to baseball, but you see stuff like that with a little bit of... It didn't cut smoothly. Oster. Randy Bush. I'm excited now. You guys excited? I'm excited about that uh, the first Griffey hit coming already. All right, who's back there? Who's back there behind Jack McDowell? Rick Aguilera. Mario Diaz. Mickey Brantley. We can go a little faster, I guess, when we see the backs of the cards, too, because we know it's going to have that rookie back. I forgot about that. Charlie Ho. Is it Ho or Hugh? Jeff Robinson. Junior Felix. Rick Mahler. All right. Nothing in pack nine. Moving on to pack ten. I really, I really do miss Upper Deck's... Uh, quality and design and yeah they do other stuff but i collect look at all this shrapnel Man, this these silver packs leave all sorts of silver pack dust on my table um i collect baseball almost almost exclusively i do some basketball and i'll buy in a football if if i want to help fill a break or something but but i really would love to see some upper deck baseball again Doug Jones, Jeff Bittinger, Mike Stanley, Ramon Martinez, Wally Joyner. Uh, sorry, just watching my phone for anything that comes up. Keith Anderson. Atherton. Keith Anderson is actually a friend of mine. Jody Davis. Not famous, that's just his name. Mickey Tettleton. I don't know what it was about him, too. I, I used to like his cards. I had different criteria when I was like 10, so that's uh, Felix Jose. I got excited. Shane Raleigh, Daryl Miller, Trevor Wilson, Ray Kionis. That was pack 10. And I, I, you know, in shipping and everything else, I will treat every card in here like it's a rookie. Um, And, you know, take care of them in shipping like normal. That's pack 11 for Sean C. You gotta remember to show the pack numbers on the thing. Tom Glavin, Dan Petrie, Thad Bosley, Kelly Downs, Huff, all right, Ted Higuera, Ken Daniels, Russell, Dwight Gooden, Mike, Mike Maddox. All right. Okay, Varsho, Bob Brower, Randy Reddy, Bill Spires, Kevin Blankenship. Okay, that was pack 11 for Sean. Pack 12 is going to be James. Actually, James has 12, 13, and 14. Good luck, James. Let's see if we can pull you a, a Griffey. James has been, uh, man, some of the glue, I guess just with age, little parts of the glue have just dried up and separated. James has been uh, really showing the hobby code. There's pack 12. Um, lately, giving away spots to people and like just some really nice stuff. So thank you, James, for that. I, you know, on behalf of other people and myself, I appreciate that. Jay Bell. Jim Wallwander, Gary Thurman, Tim Burtzis, Gene Larkin, Kevin Seitzer, Rob Ducey, Jackie Giertes. I'm going to butcher some of these. And, and then I'll just keep moving. Is that Canseco? Yeah. Uh, I'm not going to dwell on any that I mess up. Neil, uh, Ken Williams, Neil Allen, Dave LaPointe. I'm going to, when I'm done with this, I'm going to have uh, 
a table and a handful of silver glitter. It's going to look like I came back from a strip club or something. 13. 13 is James. I don't know why I looked. I know 13 and 14 are both James. Any more guesses? Anyone who hasn't guessed? Uh, it's still open for guesses. So Stan Javier, Pulio, Larry Owen. I'm glad to see some extra people joining today. Uh, Wallace Johnson, Greg Walker. So thanks to everyone who's joining and watching today. Kirk McCaskill. Make sure to subscribe if you haven't already. Roger McDowell it really helps me out. Uh, Mike Pegley. Pagliarulo. It's a rough one. It's a sticker. Mariner sticker. Who's behind you, Mike? Do we have two behind there? No, just one. Candy Maldonado. Luis something. Charlie Huff. You know, now that you say it, it sounds familiar. Charlie Huff. Kelly Downs. Bob Stanley. Not Griffey, not Griffey. Okay, that's 13. And continuing for James. Yes, absolutely. You know, uh, I think it was James who hit the, the Jeter, actually. He was, he was in the second Jeter hunt. And he bought up the uh, all the remaining spots and gave them away. It's pack 14 for James. And then got the Jeter at the end. Good karma. Uh, my throat's getting a little hoarse, so I'm not going to go through every single name here. But I will show them so that you can see each card. It's funny, some of these cards, um, like for Upper Deck's first year, there's fewer flaws than I'm seeing in some of the 2019 and 20 stuff where you see print lines and stuff like that so um that's nice i always like this card too this you know at least back then i thought that was a pretty cool card the rookie checklist gene larkin lefferts gerald perry okay no griffey 15 we're not even halfway through so there's still plenty of time i need, I need to remember to show the pack numbers because I could just pull any any pack out of another box that I know doesn't have a Griffey and just open it and not show the number if I uh, felt so inclined to rip people off. Make more. Mickey Tuttleton. I would never do that, obviously, but um, De Leon. But, you know, that's why I want to show every... Every pack, there's a sticker hiding there. There we go. Cardinals sticker. Then Cuisenberry. I don't know if the stickers are worth anything. Usually they aren't. But you never know. Like, Because the stickers in 1989, I could see people taking the stickers. I probably did this with mine. There's Barry Bonds. Uh, taking the stickers and putting them on the notebooks you keep the cards in. Eddie Murray. All right, nothing in 15. No Griffey, anyway. Smash, how are you? You guys are on tonight, right? It's Saturday. It's a ripping gypsy night. Oh, this is pack 16. 15 was for Jen. 16 is for Kevin M. Uh, good. We we did this a second ago. You might have missed that. Where are you, Pack 8? There you go. So we pulled the first one already. Jody Davis, Jeffrey Leonard. Bouchelle. Cleburne. It's close to my last name. Hubbard, Jordan, Bettinger. I have the 1990 Upper Deck uh, Michael Jordan, which is a really cool card. I don't think I would ever sell that one. 
Eddie Murray, Ron Washington, uh, Jerry Royster, Oral Hershiser. I forgot about that. It's the other pitcher. I, I almost started collecting Oral Hershiser cards. Danny Cox, Jeff Reardon, Gary Sheffield. That was the rookie to collect. Everyone said get your Gary Sheffield card back in the day. <clears throat> That was 16. On to 17 for Jen again. Uh, Smash, we're also doing guesses. You can still guess until I get it. Nobody guessed pack eight, so nobody gets a free auto or hit or whatever from me for that one. But if you guess what pack, if we pull another uh, Griffey and you guess the pack, you get two guesses. Um, then, uh, whoever guesses, I'll send something cool to Jerry Reed. Bunch of names. I'm probably not going to read upside down. All right. So this is who we're talking about, right? Ted Simmons, Hall of Fame, 2020. Dennis Lamp. There's a rookie. Mark Lemke. So close. Not Griffey, though. Reddy. Paredes. Smith. Norm. Charlton. And Pete O'Brien. Sorry, Jen. No Griffey. In pack 17. Oh, and before we go on to pack 18, we're almost halfway through. This showed up in the mail the other day with, uh, with some comics that I got. Um, and so I'm going to add this to the 1995 finest box as a, uh, cause that is a pick your team. So I'll add that to the finest and whatever cards come out of that, go to the teams that they belong to. So thanks to Rip and Gypsy for that extra pack, by the way. Two guesses, 34 and 32. All right. Yeah, you can have, uh, two guesses. Obviously, you can't guess pack eight anymore. Sorry, this is pack 18. 18 for Chris E. Sometimes I go on autopilot and I forget to show the pack and say who it is. Lance McCullers, Mike Boddicker, Stan Hay Javier, uh, Ruben Sierra, Tim Burke, Ricky Henderson. It's a nice Ricky card with a Yankees logo, which is not... Oh, I guess it's kind of centered in the circle. Bob Denier. Denier. This is a Royals sticker. Uh, Juan Castillo. Mike Witt. Rick Sutcliffe. Hilgis. Orsalak. Corbett. Malaki, the bottom of that's kind of sucky. Kind of mel sucky. Uh, and Kevin Brown, no Griffey in that pack 18. Stickers trying to come out. All right, moving on. Pack 19. 19 is for James again. The Astros. Beautiful card. Look at that man on front. Nolan Ryan. Rick Leach. Of course, I have that card. I have almost every base card uh, up through the 2000s when they started making like 85 sets of everything. Alan Trammell. I have his bat right up there. Signed bat. Uh, Rick something. Greg Gross. Neil Allen. Bob Nepper. Al Leader. Tim Foley. Kelly Downs. Juan Bell. Steve Searcy. And nope. That's just one card. Steve Searcy. Alright. That's 19. Moving on to pack 20. Pack 20 is for JT. I don't know if I 
showed that. There's pack 20. Bob Boone, Spike Owen. Lloyd McClendon. Bob Stanley. Les Lancaster. Did I... I thought I felt the sticker. Maybe not yet. Uh, Dwight Evans. Andy Van Slyke. Glenn Braggs. Mike Young. Floyd Humans. I don't even remember that name. Alfredo Griffin. I do remember that name. This is a Brewers card. With Malter on, on the front. Rick Aguilera. Some of these feel like they're thick enough to be two cards, but not quite. Uh, Gary Redis and Kevin Romine. That was 20. Moving on to pack 21. We are more than halfway done. We are on pack 21 to Chris E. So whatever comes out of this is going to Chris. I didn't mean to rhyme twice in a row there. Ivan Calderon, Thad Bosley, Jack McDowell. The glare is horrible on this lamp. This could be a better way to not have it glare so much. Jack McDowell. I, I look up every once in a while at what you guys see, and then I'm like, oh, it's kind of hard to see. Ron Darling, Junior Ortiz, Bob Nepper, uh, Mark... Thurmond, Glenn Braggs, Mike Schmidt, John Candelaria, uh, who's behind you, Sean Hillegas. Okay, so when I hold it like that, you can't really see the name. If it's upside down, got it. Jim Rice, Chris Brown, and a checklist. There are 800 cards in this set. Oh, there's a sticker on the back there. There's 800 cards in this whole set, so it's entirely possible that there's only one of certain ones. So there's, this is one I mislabeled the first time, but it is pack 22. I crossed out 21 and it says 22. So 22 is JT. 23 and 24 are all JT. All right. Phil Bradley, Greg Brock, Howard Johnson, the whole hotel chain, Jim Gott, I don't know what he got, uh, Dave Smith, maybe I should just be punny with all the names, a couple stuck together there, uh, Bud Black, Ricky Jordan, we got Don Robinson, Sid Bream, Jimmy Key. There's Barry Bonds again. Jackie G uh, Gutierrez. Kurt Wilkerson. Tom Gordon. And Derek Lilliquist. All right. Sorry, JT, nothing in 22, but you have a couple more chances here. So 23, which I also mislabeled the first time around. Also going to JT. You should definitely go find it, Jen. It, I'm telling you, I've been resorting my whole collection and I keep coming across cards and I'm like, wow, you know, it's just really fun to, to re-encounter them. Um, so it's just been a lot of fun. I think you would enjoy it if you came across the set and looked through them again. Tracy Jones, Roberto Kelly, Jerry Reed, Ken Williams. Uh, let's see here. Sticker on the back of Cal Ripken Jr. It's a nice card. Len Lancaster, Kurt Ford. Ted Simmons again. Dennis Lamp. 
Steve Jeltz, Stan Javier, Johnny Paredes, Pete Smith, Norm Charlton, and a checklist. That was 23. 24. Huh, yeah, that's that's my problem, Jen. It's all in one room, but it's been so hard to... Like, I can't find anything sometimes. Um, most of it's organized, but the problem with this past year is I got into so many breaks and stuff. I would get, like, a bunch of cards in from a break, and it might be from, like, uh, Ben from Midwest Box Breaks, and it would be from seven different breaks, and so they're all mixed together, and rather than sort them and put them away, I would just take the whole stack and put it in a box. And So I have a lot of those that I'm going through right now. There's Kevin Gross, uh, Floyd Humans, Al Nipper, nice throwing shot, Jerome Walton, oops, Jose Uribe, Jim Presley, Doug Jennings, David Palmer, who's that Red Sox, Boggs, uh, Angel Salazar, Jose Bautista, it's Will Clark, uh, Steve Bedrosian, I haven't seen that name in a long time, Fred McGriff, Israel Sanchez, all right, nothing in 24. We're going to move on to 25 for Kevin S. Actually, 25 and 26 are both Kevin. So, good luck, Kevin. I'm trying to open all these really carefully because... I don't want to catch a corner and then find a Griffey in here. I don't want to catch a corner anyway, but uh, Devon White, Pete Stani Stanichek, uh, Greg Matthews, Dave Anderson, Kevin Romine, Mike Moore, uh, Jesse Orozco, Fred McGriff, Joe Price. Greg Swindell, Ramon Martinez, rookie, Bob Brenly, Bruce Sutter, it's a manly beard, Bruce, Todd Benzinger, Jesse Barfield. Okay, nothing in that one for Kevin, but Kevin has another shot here with pack 26. Jen, what I'm doing right now is I'm actually, I had them all sorted by year and set, but now I am sorting them by, uh, by name, by player name, which is, as you can guess, a huge undertaking with 100,000 cards. Kelly Downs, Dwayne Ward. I'm about halfway through just picking out the cards I'm keeping, and then I still have to finish sorting them. That's a cool card for Kirk, Kirk Gibson. That is a uh, MVP card for Gibson. Terry Francona, Carlton Fisk, John Farrell, Oakland Athletics sticker. This one, oh, it is holographic. It's just uh, doesn't look as cool as the other ones. Uh, Greg Matthews, Ron Hassey. Nope, there's someone behind Ron. I almost missed it. There we go. Bill Swift. He was being Swift. That's why. Uh, Cecilio Guante. Bob Walk. Vance Law. Was Bob Walk a pitcher? Because that's just some irony. He was. I thought he was a pitcher. He's got the last name Walk. And he's a pitcher. I wonder if uh, he got a lot of heat for that. Anytime he walked someone. At least in the start of his career, maybe. Okay, 27 is going to James H. How are we on time? We're 
a little, we're about an hour. This one had a rip in it, I just noticed. A little rip right there. Again, these packs are 31 years old. So uh, the condition that they're in is actually pretty decent, considering. Mike Witt, uh, Inca Viglia, Brian Harvey. There's a rookie, David West. Ken Ob Oberkfell, I can never pronounce that. Bruce Hurst. Dave Parker. I think if I if if Ob Oberkfell was my last name, I'd probably change it. And I'm not making fun of his name. I'm just saying it would make life easier on me than trying to pronounce it and then spell it to people. Danny Cox, Jim Morrison. Pete Stanichek. There's an Orioles. Rob Deere. Johnny Paredes. Steve Sachs. Forgot about Steve Sachs. Jerome Walton. Okay, no, no Griffey there. All right, who had the high number guesses? We're getting to those. 28, Chris E. 27 was James H. If I didn't say that already, I might have mixed that up. So there's 28 for Chris E. Eric Hansen. Pete Smith. Who's behind you, Pete? Uh, Dave Schmidt. Todd Burns. Bill Swift. Rick Shu. I haven't seen that name in a long time. Mel Hall, Joe Price, it's my water tracker telling me I'm supposed to drink water right now, Gary Gaetti, Kirk Gibson, Jeff Calhoun, Ron Gant, Ron Hassey, Paul Molter, Jose De Leon. Okay, 29, eight packs left. Here's pack 29 for Jared S. again. Right after this, we're going to do the finest. I don't have any breaks live on the site. I'm going to have to correct that today. Um, but there are plenty of things, uh, breaks available on rippinggypsy.com and on midwestboxbreaks.com. So be sure to check those out. Pat Borders, the logos are at the top as well. Uh, Gene Larkin, uh, John Russell, Cecilia Guante, Astros, Reynolds, Oral Hershiser, MVP, Angel Sticker, Wally Joyner, No, oh, that's just one card. Some of them just feel thicker. Ken Williams. Giants. Johnny Paredes. Otis Nixon. Oil Cam Boyd. Shane Raleigh. Walt Terrell. All right, that was 29. 30 is back to JT again. If anyone has guesses and you haven't uh, used up your two guesses, now's the time. We have six packs left after this one. Seven, including this, I guess. Okay, on top is Oral Hershiser. Jeff Reardon. There we go. Danny Cox, Mitch Webster, Alan Ashby, there's a rookie, Carlos Quintana, Gene Larkin, Cecilio again, Jeff Bittinger, Bittiger. there's no N in there, Zane Smith, look at the face, I don't know how he got his neck to be that long, I guess just in that pitch. Oh, someone's someone's hiding behind Zane. 
Tori Lovulo, Stu Kilburn, Cliburn, Steve Bouchel, Jeffrey Leonard, Dave LaPointe. All right, that was 30. Oh, I have to reach now. 31. We're on 31 now. That last one was 30. 31 is Chris E again. Hey, Kristen. I don't, I don't think I saw you pop in. Did you just get here? 31, taking guesses. You can guess anything 32 through 36 at this point. I mean, you could guess pack one, but wouldn't make any sense at this point anyway. Tommy Hinzo, Sid Bream. Did I say who this was for? I did. Chris, right? Yeah. Sid Bream, Jeff Ballard, Mike Henneman, John Smiley. Some of these are way off center. That Griffey could have been more off center. Look at that. That's horrible. I hope if we have another Griffey, it's not that off center. Uh, Don Mattingly. That's our first Mattingly there. Alvin Davis. Who are you hiding? Who's behind there? Terry Francona. I won't pull them apart. They're, they're not stuck, but they're just uh, kind of static clung together, I guess. Paglio Rulo. Brian Harvey. Paul Runge. Glenn Davis. There we go. Glenn Davis. Hilgis. Phil Bradley. Eric Hansen. Uh, I, I must not have just seen, unless you were lurking. Pack 32. So we have a guest from James for 36. Pack 32 is Kevin M. Kevin actually has a couple of these last two packs, or last several packs. Got my trash here. Okay, pack 32. That's how stiff these are. They, it just stands up. Jerome Walton. Kevin Gross. Probably had some fun with that name when he was younger. Darren Dalton. Jim Rice. Frank Viola. And Rance McCullough. Malinicus, Malinix, Jim Gotts, Ken Williams, Kevin Blankenship, there's a sticker, Junior Ortiz, Vance Law, John Cerruti. Some of these names I remember pronouncing them a different way from when I was younger. I probably just got them all wrong when I was younger. Mark Langston. We had a Dwight Gooden there. And then a checklist. Oh, you had picked 29 and 32. Okay. Well, you didn't, you didn't hit on either of those. Sorry. Uh, we're on 33... This is Jen's pack. This is your last pack, Jen. In this break, anyway. I'm going to have to stop between breaks and get rid of all this silver dust here. Uh, Dickie Thon. I forgot about that name. Omar Vizquel. Vizquel. Ruben Sierra. Johnny Ray. Uh, Rick Roden. Kirk McCaskill, Bill Pakoda. There's a rookie coming up here. Is a rookie or a MVP or something? Let's see. Bautista. It's Lance Blankenship. There's our sticker. Who's our sticker? Indians. Lance Blankenship is the rookie in that one. Jesse Roscoe. Gary Redis, 
Kenny Maldonado. Dan Quisenberry. It's hard to read upside down. Small print. Brian Harvey. Bob Melvin. Okay, well, you got a rookie, but it wasn't Griffey. Three packs left. Pack 34. It's Kevin's last pack. Kevin M's last pack. Oops. So much silver dust. My hands are so dry right now from sorting cards. Uh, Timmy Jones. Atley Handmaker. Mike Gallego, Dave Parker, Barry Jones, Phil Bradley. A lot of people rocking the mustaches. Right up into uh, right up through '89 still. Rob Dibble, Kevin Romine, Bobby Witt, Pascal Perez. Uh, we have Bill Swift. Gerald Perry, Bud Black, Wally Whitenhurst, Whitehurst. I try to put N's in names where they don't belong. Todd Zeal. So serious. Why so serious, Todd? It's just baseball. 35. 35. Uh, is Kevin S. We'll have Dickie Thawne right up on top. Dwight Smith. There's uh, two cards here. Don Carmen, and on the other side is Randy Reddy. Rick Cerrone. Daryl Hamilton. And Dave LaPointe, Neil Allen, Bosox, Sticker, Mel Hall, Harold Baines. Might be the first Harold Baines we pulled today. Uh, Tracy Jones, Mike Davis, Mark Langston, Dion James, and Ron Kittle. That was 35, so... I don't know. Maybe I was right. Maybe there's only one Griffey in this box. If there's two, it's going to be in pack 36. Didn't uh, James guess pack 36? Pack 36 is for James. So if we pull a Griffey, he's going to win twice on this. Double dipping. Todd Burns. Eric Hansen, almost dropped you, Eric. Sorry, buddy. Andy Hawkins, oh, sorry, Andy. I got butterfingers. Mark Solis, Dave Valley, Valle? I don't know. Uh, Charles Hudson, and I just saw who was back here. Danny Jackson, hiding from the photographer. Doesn't want his face shown. There's our sticker. John Smiley. Joel Youngblood. I actually know someone named Joel Youngblood. I wonder if they're related. John, uh, Ron Kittle. Larry McWilliams. Juan Samuel. I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to be extra careful not to drop the last few just in case. Todd Worrell. Wally Joyner. No Griffey. Last one's Ernie Witt. Well, we did hit Griffey. So I'm super excited about that. I wish we would have hit more than one, but I'm actually really excited that we did hit one Griffey in pack eight. Not 100% perfect, perfectly centered, but that one actually, it could possibly squeeze by uh, with PSA as a 10. I don't know. What's the back look like? Yeah, the back is pretty much the same little bit off center but don't don't tell PSA send it in see what they say anyway that was pack eight which was uh which was Ryan so congrats Ryan on that 
we will let me put that away and move my penny sleeves so I don't blow them everywhere. Give me one sec. All right, turn the turn the volume down on your computer or mute for a second. It's going to be loud. Okay. All right, sorry about that. I wanted to clear that off. Okay, so Rip and Gypsy sent me this extra pack here, which will be part of the next break that we're doing, which is the 1995 Finest. Um, so I'm going to throw that in because I got it for free. So I'm going to I'm going to pass that along to you guys. That was a nice box. That was a lot of fun. I was super excited to rip that box open. I'm I'm really glad we hit a Griffey. I would have had a lot of fun with it either way, but I'm, either way, I'm super excited that we hit a Griffey, uh, but I would, but it was a fun box. So I said the same thing like three times in a row. All right, 95 Finest, um, Ben's highlighted just because that was the last one I filled in, I think, or something, I don't know. Anyway, uh, no need to random on any of this. Some of these spots say no cards, um, which is why I didn't uh, sell those teams. So just highlight those real quick. And we'll get started. So this is 1995 Finest. They stick a little bit, but they're not too bad. Um, still, nothing has been as bad so far as 2016 Optic. I bought a case of that and did a case, a full case break. It took like four hours to do that case break. It was atrocious. It was really, really bad. Autographs were ruined. Uh, we pulled an autograph of um, the San Diego chicken, and it was ruined. Like it was just horrible. These are nowhere. These aren't bad at all. Thanks for dropping in, Jen. Thanks for dropping in, Kristen. I appreciate you guys visiting. Good luck to everyone in this break. This is a, a pick your team format. Before we did a, a pack random with this one. And I thought pick your team would be fun. So we did a pick your team. Save these cardboard. So we don't have to do any kind of randoms or anything like that with this. We can dive right in. There's all our packs. I'm gonna, I'm gonna set this heritage pack underneath so I remember to open that last. Courtesy of Rip and Gypsy. Okay, so these are gonna be kind of a pain to open. Some of my, I'll have to slice a little bit. All your teams are on the right. So good luck to all those people. Uh, this was a pick your team and we, we had a draft earlier. So that's why there's not a trade window right now. There we go. Took a minute to get out of there. And of course in this one we're looking for uh, Hideo Nomo rookie or Ken Griffey Jr. There are two, well, on average, but so far this has been my, what I've seen there. There's probably one flamethrower and one or two power kings inserts. There are two refractors in this box. There should be. Uh, and we are looking for Ken Griffey Jr. We're looking for the Hideo Nomo rookie card. Um, I think Don Mattingly, McGuire, those are good cards as well. Anyway, so we'll go kind of quick. Tim Salmon, Walbeck. Uh, who is that? The names are real hard to read. Fletcher on this design. And, and then all these also have their protective foil over them too. Anyway, Randy Myers. 
These are even worse with the light. Let's see if I can fix the lighting a little bit so I don't have as much glare. That's worse. Maybe that might be a little better. It's hard for me to see it, but uh, it'll be better on camera now. All right, so Fletcher, Myers, uh, Thome, Greenwell, Jones. Okay, nothing that really stands out in pack one. So I believe, was it Jen that grabbed, who had the Mariners? Uh, Aaron, Aaron grabbed the Mariners. So let's hope for some uh, good luck with the Griffey. We've pulled a couple out of a box before on this stuff. And this happens a lot too, um, where sometimes they'll be a little stuck together and you find it's two of the same card. Uh, each of these packs is supposed to have seven cards, and I think this one has seven, yeah. So it's still seven cards, but the two on the top are duplicate, and that happens a lot. Uh, anyway, Reggie Sanders, Jimmy Key, uh, Roger Clemens, it's not a bad card, Roberta Almar, there's a Ken Griffey Jr., there's our first Griffey out of this one. Centering is also a lot of these older cards. Um, centering can be really, really tough. But that's actually not too bad. The back looks pretty clean too. So there's our first Griffey. I will uh, top load. Any, any Griffey or Hideo Nomo I'll top load. And our... Um, our refractors all top load. Okay, so there's a Griffey. Congrats to Aaron for the Griffey. Mike Greenwell. Uh, Greg Gagne. Messina. Joe Giambi. Is that right? Girardi, got that wrong. Uh, this is Ray Lankford, Travis Fryman, John Roper. Nothing amazing out of that. The good thing about these is they're these are pretty thick cards, and they're uh, so it'd be hard for any of them to have like a damaged corner or anything like that. All right, Jeff Bagwell on top. No refractor in this one. Kenny Lofton, John Valentin, Greg McMichael, yep. uh, Eric Karos. Bobby Munoz, and Terry Steinbach. Nothing too crazy out of that one either. There's a handful of really good cards, and then there's a lot of stuff that's you could probably resell or might be might be cool cards either way for your PC, um, but uh, otherwise not really amazing, some of them. We have not pulled... And this is the last box in a case that I bought. I had a whole case, and we haven't pulled any gold. Um, that would be really incredible to find one of those, but I haven't come across one yet. Okay, Andy Van Slyke. Uh, Andy Van Slyke. Jeff Bagwell. Uh, Matt Walbeck. This is Wilson Alvarez. Delino de Shields and Jeff Kent. We'll do the same thing on this one if anyone can guess. Uh, if we pull another Griffey uh, or a Hideo Nomo or, uh, or Donnie Baseball. If we pull any of those three and you guess what pack we'll pull it out of, 
you can't guess the one we already pulled. But you get one guess, and if you guess what pack we pull out of, I'll send you something special. You don't have to be in a break. I will cover the shipping and just send you something. There's Ricky Henderson times two. Some of these have a little uh, streaks on the top, which might actually kind of rub out a little bit, but it's also on the protective film, and then some don't. This one has a little bit of a line across. Anyway, Tom Green. Yeah, Tommy Green. Uh, Roberto Hernandez. We'll do... There's something stuck. Take a second. There's Barry Bonds. That's not a bad hit. Uh, Dave Clark. And then behind Hernandez is... Thought it might be a refractor or something. Nope. Uh, Chad Curtis behind Hernandez. All right. Nothing in that one. Nothing amazing. All right. We have guesses. James guesses 13. Our resident judge guesses 15. Oh, I should probably count what, what pack we're on, huh? So, how many packs was that? I have lost count. How many do we have left? Three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17. There's 24 in here, if I'm not mistaken. So, uh, if there's 17 left, then I will figure out if we hit one. Uh, Tettleton, Avery, Langston, Delgado, Dante Bichette, Jim Thome, Jim Thome. All right. Well, we have a, what's this one called? Power Kings, I think. There's Juan Gonzalez, Roger Clemens, there's Griffey. So if this is... I'm going to count them real quick just so I know where we're at. Okay, cool. So there's 49. That's seven packs down. This is pack eight. We didn't have a guess for eight. Uh, anyway, so Griffey Jr., which is always good. I think the book price is like $10 for Griffey in this. Fairly well centered on that one. Uh, and then we have Bob Hamlin. And this is the uh, Power Kings. That's what Power Kings looks like. Uh, Bayerga, Fielder, Dunstan, Roger Clemens, Juan Gonzalez. All right, so this will be pack nine then. Oh, these spoil packs sometimes. All right, pack nine. We got Karos, Eric Karos on top. 
And multiple people can guess uh, the same number. That's cool, too. Sissel Fielder. Mike Henneman. Something on the back of Mike Henneman. I'll get that in a sec. Jeff Conine. Uh, Randy Johnson's another decent card to hit out of this. It's not horrible, anyway. And the one that was stuck was uh, Greg Gagne. Okay, so that was nine. Pack ten. Oh my goodness. We're never going to make it to uh, pack 12 to see if your guess is right. There we go. Here we go. So Ben's on tonight. Uh, I think he's starting at 7. We'll be done by then. So make sure and check that out. MidwestBoxBreaks.com Steve Avery. Ray Lankford. Uh, Ramon Martinez. Kenny Lofton. Kenny Lofton, the middle pack, the middle card always has someone stuck. Still no refractor yet. Robin Ventura, um, Brett Butler, and Todd Zeal. Is that nine or ten? I lost count again. Yeah, 14. That was pack 10. Okay, pack 11. There's a refractor. Okay, pack 11 has a refractor. We have Wilson Alvarez times two. We have Greg Gagne, and our refractor is Ryan Klesko for the Braves. So the refractor goes to Aaron. So far, Aaron's got, oh, and I didn't really say the Royals got the uh, Power Kings. The Royals was Scott Petz. Aaron got the two Griffies so far, and then also the Ryan Klesko refractor. I really love these refractors. The finest, the base are cool, but the refractors are super cool. Okay, and then last few cards, uh, Mike McFarlane, Rod Beck, Kevin Tapani. That was 11. Pack 12. All right, let's see. Hopefully we got a Griffey in here for you, John. I mean, it won't be your Griffey, but you'll get something from me. Bonus. On top of the bonus. I think I have bonuses I'm supposed to give you already. Uh, all right. Rene Rocha, Mark Langston. Uh, that is Steve Taschel, Darren Lewis, always the middle two cards stick a little bit, uh, Andy Van Slyke, Rick Aguilera, sometimes is Craig Biggio, sometimes you'll get a card like that where the, you can see that corner, where the foil is starting to come up a little on the corner. And those, if you're gonna, if it was a card worth grading or something, we're on 13. That would be the uh, time you would pull the foil off, probably. I mean, I probably would. All right, pack 13. There was anything special in 12. 13. Jeff Conine. Chad Curtis. J.R. Phillips, Jim Thome, uh, Tim Nearing, Marvin Freeman, J. Bell. 
That's 13. 14. Okay. We're more than halfway through. We have uh, Bayerga, probably another Bayerga on back. Yeah, two Bayergas stuck together. Greg McMichael, Alan Watson, Ricky Henderson, Mike Piazza. It's not a bad card to hit. And Eddie Williams. Yep, so 15. Wait, is this? Or 6. I don't know if my pack count is off or not, but we'll see. Robin Ventura, Robin Ventura, uh, Rico Brogna, Roger Clemens. Behind Roger is John Jaha, Dennis Eckersley. David Justice. I would love to see a gold refractor out of here. Especially if it was... Uh, well, that one's not gold, but it's a refractor. This is pack 16, I believe. Especially if it was Griffey. Anyway, there's a uh, Mike Henneman. Mike Henneman. Cal, Cal Eldri Eldred. Cal Eldred. Our refractor, actually I'll do that last so I can show the other cards and then set them down. Moises Alou, uh, Chris Hoyles. Refractor has a second card behind it, which is Joe Girardi. I want to pull them apart, but I don't want to, there we go. I don't want to damage one. And anyway, anyway, there's Joe Girardi, and then our refractor is Cliff Floyd. That's not a bad refractor. I think the Cliff Floyd base is worth a couple bucks, but uh, refractor would be even better, obviously. And uh, the Cliff Floyd is the Expos. Who who picked the S Expos in the last minute draft? Nick. Nick got the Expos by way of a uh, random act of kindness, by the way, from uh, James earlier today, like a couple hours ago, not, not very long ago. All right. So we've pulled two refractors. There's still room to pull uh, Hideo Nomo. Rookie or additional Griffies or other cool cards. There's Piazza, McFarlane, uh, Rob Nin, Eric Karos, Kevin Seitzer, Moises Alou, and Carlos Garcia. Bobby Ayala, Darren Lewis, 
Roberto Hernandez, Tom Candiotti, Matt Walbeck, Jay Booner, and Scott Cooper. It's weird the font that they use on this, along with the design, makes it a little hard to read some of the names. Tim Nairing, Tim Nairing, Bob Hamlin, Mark Langston, Paul O'Neill, Jay Booner, Bip Roberts. I've seen that name a couple days. Who's still on? Who's in chat? Say hi. as we get close to the end here. Alan Watson, times two. Jim Thome, uh, Hector Carrasco, Roberto Hernandez, Tom Glavine, Walt Weiss, Anyone else still in chat? Thanks for chiming in, Jen and John. The Shields, Jaha, hint if you're on chat, it's your benefit to say hello right now. Chad Curtis, Carlos Bayerga. John Crook, Tom Glavine, J.R. Phillips, and don't forget we still have this heritage pack that Ribbon Gypsy sent me that we're going to rip at the end here. We have this and two more packs of the finest and then the heritage after. Luis Gonzalez. Uh, Jose, or sorry, Joe Girarde, David Cohn, Kurt, what's your last name, Kurt? Abbott, I should know that. Kurt Abbott, James, thanks for chiming in, Kenny Lofton, Darren Fletcher, uh, Alex Fernandez, Judge, thanks for staying on with me. Kevin Seitzer, we know you have your choice of breakers, David Need, and we appreciate you choosing to break with Card Warehouse. Don't forget your carry on luggage, Greg Gagney. Uh, Royce Clayton, Chili Davis, Mark Witten. All right, one more finest pack. Look at that, how lucky. It opened easily for me. And we'll, we'll do this heritage pack last and see if there's anything exciting in there. Paul O'Neill, times two. Uh, Ray Sanchez, Andy Van Slyke. Mike Bordick, uh, Ivan Rodriguez, and David Need. And finally, we have this Heritage Pack, which could contain anything. This is um, 2019 Heritage. 
thanks again to Rippin Gypsy for including that in in my stuff. And so I just thought I'd pay that for it and just uh, open it for for this break. And these cards go to the people that that have these teams. So for example, Blake Parker here for the Angels is going to go to Aaron B. Okay, uh, Chris Davis, Mike Zunino, Ryan Yarbrough, All Star rookie, J.D. Martinez. Uh, new Age Performers. Travis Shaw, it's been a while since I opened these. Matt Chapman. Jose Martinez. And Nunez. Pinch Hit Seals. Okay. Nothing exciting in there, but that's still kind of cool to have. Okay, so for the five people, we have Jen, John, James, and Judge. Who did I miss? I missed someone. Hold on, I gotta peek real quick. I wonder if it's gonna show me. Oh, I can't scroll back. All right, so let me know if I missed you. Um, I'm gonna send you guys each something. I'll send you a hit or something. I appreciate you guys sticking it out through the boring part of the, the very end of the break. And uh, so I just want to send you guys something. Let me write down a note before I forget. Especially since we didn't get, oops, since we didn't get, uh, we didn't hit any, any of the guesses. So the Jays rule, yep. So Jen, James, Jen M, James H. John, I'm gonna have to add a bunch of stuff to yours. And uh and judge. Okay. I made a note. I'm gonna make sure and send you guys something. So, uh you guys have an hour to kill before um before Ben's on tonight. I'm going to eat something, sort, and then I might watch some breaks with you guys with uh, with Ben. I may, may tune in, may not. I got a lot of stuff to do. But anyway, that's it for today. I appreciate you guys joining in, uh, chatting, and joining the breaks, those who did. Um, the hit of the, the day really was this Ken Griffey Jr. The, the iconic, as it's often described, iconic. 1989 King Griffey Jr. Fairly well centered. This is a nine at worst and a possible ten. I think it could I think it could possibly get a ten. Cause the centering's not like 2080. The centering is maybe 60-40 or 55-45. So anyway, congrats again to Ryan for hitting that. And uh, congrats to everyone on, on all the other cards. There's a lot of good cards here um, be, beyond just that one. We'll get some more breaks up on the site very soon. And uh, Jen, I owe you a site credit as well. I'll get that to you. I don't have breaks up on the site right now, but I'll get that to you uh, today. Thanks, everyone. Uh, I will catch you in Ben's Breaks or in Rip and Gypsy uh, either way. And... Anyone who's watching this either uh, right now or recorded later, playing it back, uh, please do ask me about the uh, break club that we're all a part of. The three breakers that, that I mentioned myself, Rip and Gypsy and, and um, Midwest Box Breaks are all part of this break club network. And there's a break club where a bunch of us get together and, and we all talk about cards and share and help each other. And it's just a great place to be. So you want to be there. Ask me about it if you're not in there already. And I will catch you guys later. Have a good Saturday.